Hey, welcome back to GS Pro V2 Tips. I wanted to take a few minutes to talk about golf courses. So what I mean by that is there's been a lot of talk on Facebook, and I do uh, try to comment, I do try to read, and I do try to answer questions that are in the various Facebook groups as well as on Discord. And here lately, there's been a lot of conversation about I can't see all the golf courses. I can't download a golf course. I can't do this or that as it pertains to golf courses. So today, let's take a quick minute and run through the various things we can do as it pertains to downloading and using golf courses and what data is available to us. So let's get right into it. So here's my installation of GS Pro. So you may see my name and whatnot up here. And we're going to try to avoid names, numbers, the user IDs, etc. And before we jump in all the way, do me a favor, subscribe, give me a like down below. It really helps um, in my dreams of becoming a big time content provider. No, I'm just kidding. But every little bit does help. So please share, like, subscribe. And if you have any questions or you have any ideas for content, please leave a comment down below. I look forward to interacting with you. All right, so in order to get to the golf courses uh, in GS Pro, you go into your local match. Local match, you'll see all the golf courses by default that you have on your computer. So let's take a look at the different pieces parts here. First, we have the search bar. The search bar can search on any of the fields and attributes that you see here. You want to search by Minot. How many golf courses are in Minot? Well, we have Minot, 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 Minot. So it looks like we have four of them. If you want to look for golf courses by TechBud, you can see and search by TechBud. If you want to look for golf courses that are by me, <laughs> you can see the golf courses that I have done or have been involved in. Also, you can sort, uh, you can view by and search by state, although that's not as effective because the letters VA for Virginia are also going to come up in the words Valley, also going to come up in words uh, out there other than, again, Valley. So VA, Virginia, VA, Virginia, VA, Virginia, Valley. So that veil, those are tougher when you're searching by state because of the abbreviation and hopefully we'll get something different here soon. You can also search by um, golf course. So let's say that you wanted to go to Sandy, Sand something, just the word Sand, Old Sandwich, Sands. Uh, Royal St. George's in Sandwich, UK. So as you can see, the search is somewhat helpful. But that's the search. All right. How you sort? You can sort by the name of the golf course, from the um, alphabetically A to Z or from Z to A, the newest golf course at the top, the oldest golf course at the top, locations. So you can sort by, we don't have a location. So let's sort location in the other direction. So here we go with Washington, Wyoming, etc. So it's sorted by that Y, that Y. It looks like that Y in the city. So we can also sort by designer. We can also sort by availability. Now that one is a big one for me because I like sorting from the most available golf course down to the least available. And I'm going to show you more of that in a minute. So let's go with name. Um, view. You can look at it in a list view, which is what I have in a detail view, or you can look at it in a pane view, which will give you a quick snapshot of a thumb, uh, a thumbnail of a picture that the designer has posted. Um, you can play the course and you can, um, of course, friendly the course. So in either view, um, you can add a star. So as we move across to this particular bar here, we've covered Search, how to sort. We have covered the views. 
title and thumbnail we've covered filtering based on our favorites you can see here these are my favorites you can add some more if you'd like by simply clicking the star which adds it to your favorite and also this little cool button is say hey let's go out there and randomly select a golf course to play click it and it went to Southboro Golf Club. If I go back and I click it again, it's going to go the Winter Wonderland. So let's go back out of that. So that's randomizer that you can select for fun. You say, I don't know what course to play. Just click that button and have some fun with it. And again, show courses show all courses i should say that shows you everything that you do not have in your library so for example let's just say i want to delete this course and i don't uh, so now i don't show that course because i'm only looking at courses that i have so all courses by availability is how i sort and you can see i can now download it and play it Okay, now we have the list of courses, the name of the course on the left. We have their location, city, state, and country. We have the designer. We have the date it was last updated, the version, whether or not you want to delete the course if you no longer want it. Also, this little notepad or clipboard. This clipboard will show you if you have played a golf course yet and what those scores look like. So let's take a look at a course that I know that I've played several times. Mattapanai. You can see here that I've played it. Um, oh, wow, I've played it quite a lot, actually. It'll show you the course name, the date, what the type of scoring it was, whether it was stroke, match, scramble, what your score was. And also you can click on the little clipboard. What, what my record was minus four looks to be like my best round there take a look a minus four oh an eagle i don't remember this round but i played it there's my name um if you played with somebody else that'll also be there i don't know if i have any oh that's a nothing i just loaded it and left ah. um so anyways you can look and see if you played it with somebody else as well so that's what that oh that's that's a terrible day at the at the golf course but anyways you get the oh there we go there's somebody i, I played around with somebody i'm glad i found one uh looks like i lost that day ha! anyways that's what that's all about and then of course the star and then of course clicking play so you've heard conversations about patreon patreon site servers for pay etc and you can find that list of servers here and you can add it to here i'm not going to show you because i don't want anyone to get a list of that but if you have the patreon site you can type it in um patreon.techbud.com slash courses it's not really a real thing but you could then click the, the click the little button here add courses and be done with it so Get rid of that, close that, and that'll add it to your list. You can also head over to Discord. Head on over to the OPCD Discord server, which is right over here. Right? Da 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 da, there it is. Zero than one golf course design. Head on over to the user beta testing channel. Head on up to your pinned messages, and you'll see the URL to add directions like i just showed you on how to add those and then new courses will pop up that are in beta test once you find a course that you want to play and you've played that course and you want to provide some feedback you can simply find the list from the list of servers here that are being currently being built and tested and come on over here and leave a comment loved the course Three on hole four is not bouncing balls back. It 
went right through. All right, so there you, there you go. You can leave that type of a comment. Please be respectful. Please do it in the way of, of um, constructive criticism, um, but be kind, right? These guys and gals have worked endless hours on learning how to do this. So just be kind, but give them good information that will help make the course better. It's always welcomed. So where can we find these courses? Well, if we take a look at this particular window, you will see that they are in your C drive and GS Pro for GSP and courses. All the golf courses are here. Okay. Once you take a look at that, you can then see that it can be found in settings under game under courses. Okay. That's the place to type it. If you want to move it, you can do so by typing D colon of my D drive uh, DS Pro DS Pro my courses. But that's where you want to store them. And move your courses, copy them to that folder, and from there, that's where the location will be when you download it. Click save, which I'm going to cancel by clicking close. And I don't want to move my golf courses. Last but not least, if you are having a problem with getting courses, first and foremost, check your internet. Once you check your internet, I would like you to then check your DNS settings to make sure that you're using external DNS settings and check to see if you're using Google, which is 8.8.8.8 is a good way to go. And last but not least, there's some things that you could do to help yourself as well. Clear cache and reload courses. Clearing the cache will clear out any memory of the game that is stored up of what courses are loaded. If there's a newer course that you added, it'll clear the cache so the new one can load in there. And then reloading the courses is going to tell it to go back out to the server list, re-download the, 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 the JSON file of what is out there for available courses. And always, always, always to remember, if you're looking for a new course you don't have, to check this checkbox. I can't stress that enough. I hope that this information has been helpful to each and every one of you on everything there is to know about downloading golf courses, finding golf courses, what data is available, what you can do, how to add a Patreon, how to beta test, where to find the information, where the courses are stored at locally on your computer, and how to change that particular location. So thanks for tuning in once again to GS Pro V2 Tips, and I hope this has been helpful. Please subscribe, like, share the video, tell others about the information that we have here. But most importantly, have fun playing golf. And until next time, hit them straight.